The Bharatiya Janata Party has now gone all guns blazing again. Jharkhand Chief Minister Hemant Soren saying, "What alliance is this? This is an alliance of confusion and corruption." BJP Shahzad Poonawala has said, and I quote him here, that uh, this India alliance is an, a, a block alliance of corruption and confusion. Sonia Rahul are on bail. Hemant Soren is untraceable. First time in history that a chief minister is missing in action, as per reports that he's quoting. Now he's claiming, according to Shahzad Poonawala, the only glue here is that of corruption that keeps the alliance together. Remember, RJD chief. Yes, Lalu Prasad Yadav also has been questioned for 10 hours. He's also a very significant part of the India Alliance. So the BJP is jumping in to say, well, there are only corruption allegations here. There is confusion about their whereabouts. This is what the India Alliance is about. So Shahzad Poonawala early this morning has jumped in, uh, looking at, of course, uh, the fact that uh, Hemant Soren, the Jharkhand chief minister, is untraceable. Lalu Prasad Yadav is uh, being questioned for 10 hours. Tejashwi Yadav, his son, former deputy chief minister of Bihar, has been summoned today. Abhishek Anand, my colleague, is joining me. He's right outside Hemant Soren's residence. Abhishek, good morning. BJP is clearly jumping on this issue specifically as the Jharkhand chief minister cannot be traced. Perhaps he will make an appearance uh, 24 hours from now. But you're outside the chief minister uh, of uh, Hemant Soren. What is the situation like at that point there? Uh, stay on with me. Abhishek, I apologize to interrupt you there. Shahzad Punawala is joining me on the phone line. Shahzad, you're using strong words against the India bloc saying this is a, what binds them or glues them together is corruption and confusion. Uh, see, they have no mission or vision. Puja, they only have commission and corruption. And therefore, their slogan is, Prashtachar mera shishtachar, Prashtachar mera jantar adhikar, koi pakadega to chillaunga atyachar, atyachar, or khelunga victim would card. Jharkhand CM is missing in action as per media reports. The Kejriwal Delhi CM, he questions the agencies itself. When TMC leaders are investigated by ED, they can attack ED itself. Rahul Sonia are out on bail. Lalu has already gone to jail. And DMK Spawn Moody has been convicted. This is their alliance. Their alliance has only one savvy call, Hindu hatred and corruption. And therefore, today, you can see one after the other, as the corruption action is taking place, you can see one CM will not go for summons like Mr. Kejriwal. The other CM will go into hiding. Where is Heman Soren? How is the state of Jharkhand functioning? Isn't it his constitutional duty to be available as the chief minister? This is a complete betrayal, not only of his constitutional mandate and duties, but it also shows that what level the India alliance is at, whether it's Dheeraj Sahu, whether it's the corruption of Kejriwal, whether it's the corruption of Lalu, corruption of DMK leaders, or corruption of Jharkhand CM, they all stand in solidarity because except for corruption and commission, they have nothing in common. That the JMM and the RJD, whose leaders are being summoned by the agencies, are also maintaining via their statement that this is all political witch hunt because they are in the opposition, because they don't want to ally with the Bharatiya Janata Party, is because they, that's why the agencies have been pushed after them. What would you say to that as a BJP leader? Uh, Pooja, you would know, and your uh, reporters from Jharkhand will testify that Mr. Soren approached the courts to cancel the summons because he got no relief. Kejriwal's uh, Kattar, Imandar, Sodhya and Sanjay Singh are languishing in jail thanks to the courts. How come they got no relief? And Congress, by the way, celebrates those actions. And also, Sonia and Rahul have got no relief. And by the way, Lalu has been convicted. First time he was convicted was in 2013. Paul Moody has been recently convicted, you remember. Central Balaji is not being given bail by the Supreme Court. So our courts also playing with the BJP. So I think this kind of excuse is only a victimhood card. Today the question is that what is the stand of India Alliance on corruption? They can take no stand because they are all standing with corruption. Corruption and confusion, says uh, BJP spokesperson Shahzad Poonawala, that this is what binds them together, otherwise they have nothing to show. Appreciate you joining us, Shahzad. Let's go across to my colleague Abhishek. Abhishek, so you're at to Himant Soren residence. Any activity there inside? Uh, any details of whether he's likely to come, who all are inside, what happened yesterday? Because it appears that 24 hours from now will be crucial if he makes a presence or not. Well, certainly, Pooja, uh, this is the Delhi residence of Heman Surin. And since yesterday, only the security personnel can be seen going inside and outside. Yesterday, the uh, ED team had actually seized a car and some documents 
from this particular residence but since then there has been no activity as we can see only the security personnel who are deployed here are changing shifts and going inside and outside when we asked about people who work here about the whereabouts of uh, uh, Mr. Soren they were unable to tell us anything and there is no clue of Soren right now in this area where is he remains a big question puja and no activity here you can see so uh, the ed team maybe the ed team will come again here but right now it doesn't look like hmm. there is anything left especially especially in the daddy residence of yes. him and Soren, though the uh, there are reports of him calling meeting of his MLAs in Jharkhand but the biggest question is where is he exactly Puja very interesting so he was seen in Delhi reported to be in Delhi about a day ago but not here anymore airports have been put on alert but ED is looking for him when will him and Soren appear before the agency and cooperate with the investigation Abhishek Anand and all our colleagues will be tracking the latest from Delhi and Jharkhand